Local doctors and nurses are putting in countless hours on the front lines, saving the lives of COVID-19 patients. And one of those patients in Martin County is a commercial fisherman known for his boat charter and charity work. Our Megan McRoberts reports tonight how the fishing community plans to show the hospital their gratitude. Patrick Price with Daymaker Charters has been inside Cleveland Clinic. Martin Health's North Campus here for nearly a month battling COVID-19. You see the hospital is right along the St. Lucie River. That's why a flotilla is planned right out here this weekend so that the staff in there can see the support out here. Yeah, Bill. Miles offshore is where 42 year old Patrick Price has earned his reputation. Pat, I've known for, like I said, six, seven years now, just from the water, being a fisherman. The owner of Daymaker Charters, Patrick has helped countless crews over the years reel in a picture worthy catch. People that come and visit, you know, all around the world, fish his boat. Travis Wilson says Pat has earned a lot of respect by putting his contacts and his boats to good use for the community. Fishing tournaments, helping with veterans, um, you know, a real staple to the community. Even stepping up following Hurricane Dorian. Multiple flights and, and boat transports back and forth. Patrick contracted COVID-19 in July and since July 22nd has been admitted at Cleveland Clinic Martin North, documenting his progress on Facebook July 25th, 28th, on August 10th. Update after update, I'm like, holy crap, he's in the hospital. Oh man, he's on a ventilator. Now he needs a transfer to another hospital to be put on an ECMO machine. And at this point, his only hope, I would say. Wilson decided to organize a flotilla to pass behind the hospital, knowing how badly the medical staff needs to see and feel support. Buy lunch, just show support. Wilson was a cardiac patient here in the past and credits these same doctors for saving his life. If they didn't fight as long, I'd admit I wouldn't be here. So uh, doctors are it. Hoping the flotilla lets them see their work on Patrick and other COVID fighters isn't unnoticed. Show them that we, we still care that you're in there and uh, fighting for us. The flotilla is set for 11 a.m. this Saturday. You can come and go as you please. You're encouraged to bring signs. And if you can't get on a boat, Wilson just hopes you'll find your own way to support your local hospitals. In Martin County, I'm Megan McRoberts, WPTV News Channel 5.